All right. Here I'm about to show you guys, some of you guys beginners, just a little quick uh, how to set up for your um, for your 90, all right? So this is what it looks like. I'm gonna get down to show you guys. So if you look, I got this much space from this, from this line all the way to here, all right? We'll close the door so you guys can see. So I got this much space in between the trailer you see all the trailers? That's how much space I got between those trailers. All right, I'm gonna show you guys the next step. All right, once you got that set up right there, this is what you would do. Um, all right, I'm gonna show you guys right now. Um, all right, you will drive up to the slot that you're gonna be into. Though the slot I'm gonna be into is right here. All right, it's open between these two trailers. So, once I see that my fifth wheel has hit this trailer right here, I will make a hard right and swing out, all right? So I'm gonna show you guys a hard right, right? Away from the slot, your fifth wheel. Remember, you turn a hard right, and once you start seeing your center point of the, uh, between the, the trailer across from you, you start going center, all right? All right, see this? You see where you see where my my the tread the where my trailer is going. Look at the trailer. Where is it going? Okay. All right. Once you see that you have gone out, you see the slot I'm going to park at. It's right there. You come out that far, all right? So you guys. I'm about, I'm about to show you guys, all right? I give myself a little bit of space farther away from the, um, farther away from the, um, the two trailers that I'm going, the two slots that I'm going to park in, all right? So this is what I'm going to do. These are the two slots that I'm going to park in between, all right? And you see where my trailer is at? How far am I up there? I'm about roughly about, um, 15 feet away from the slot, 10 feet, uh, 20 feet away from the slot. So I'm gonna make it into this slot right here, right? Remember, my tandem is all the way forward, all right? So once you, uh, once you're, you're the, the last tire right here touches uh, in between these two trailer right here, in between this trailer right here, you start cutting. You will start cutting um, hard right to make your trailer go swing out to the left, right? And the reaction, once you cut right here, the reaction will, the reaction of uh, the, the tire will react uh, eight seconds before um, it, it even reacts, start turning, okay? So, I'm sorry to start showing you guys. <sighs> okay. So, you will start putting yourself in reverse. And go find, and just just put your steering wheel back to straight. And your, your trailer will start reacting, will start moving. Okay. Okay. All right, now the invisible line where I'm gonna meet that spot where I told you guys earlier where you're gonna start cutting the right, that's where you're gonna start cutting. So my tire has to touch that imaginary line where I say I was gonna cut at. So that's what I'm gonna do right now, start cutting. Cutting hard right, all right? S slowly but gently, not too hard, just enough so I can know where my trailer is going. I'm guiding my trailer. So cut, start cutting hard. I'm a little bit too uh I'm, I'm a little bit too uh too too uh too late. So I'm gonna go back again, go forward a little bit more, and cut a little bit earlier than what I did before. So I'm start cutting. Alright, start cutting. There we go. I'm gonna start having a little bit of better reaction now. So see where your trailer is going. See you look. Look at your trailer. Start cutting. As you start seeing the where you start, uh, uh, where it is, it is uh, going to be cutting at. So, all right, I'm gonna show you guys the key point. Uh, how I usually do it. Uh, 
No, I'm still not really good at this, so I'm just gonna give you guys a little quick note. Uh, use your get out look. You guys get out look. Alright. So I'm gonna show you guys how to get out look. So you see the where my tire is at and where the trailer is at, it's sort of it's gonna hit there if I cut out even more. So that's why I'll turn my steering wheel all the way to the left. And just a note, you see where my trailer is gonna hit if I cut too much right? You see that? So basically, I want to turn the steering wheel a little bit to a little bit more to keep it to the left like that. And and when you when you make your steering go to the left, it'll come out straight more this way. So you see, I have no space on this side. So I want I want my the the I want that bumper right here to be touching this line right here. So if it touches this line right here, that means I'm good. That means I'm not gonna hit this. All right. So let's go back in the truck and let's get it in. Remember, your truck is, it reacts a little bit slower because you're at the 40 foot mark. When you have your tandems all the way to the rear, it reacts really fast, okay? Remember that. But you also need a lot of space in front of you. So I'm gonna put you guys back up in there. All right, let's get back. So keep my steering wheel to the left because I need, I need to go more to the right. Swing out more to the right. So. All right. There you go. Now you start cutting. Once you once you see your your tire touches that yellow line, both of your tires start cutting right. Yeah. See, see how it reacts. There you go. I hope you guys have seen this. I cannot explain it any any more easier than this. Uh, remember, you're controlling the trailer. All right. You're, you're driving the trailer, you're not driving the truck, okay? Just remember that, all right? So once you see... So you guys. So yeah, once, you're, once, you're, once, you're, once you're, your tandem tires touches that yellow line, all you do is straighten the back in there now. All you, all you know that your trailer is straight. So that's all you need to know, right? So let's fix this in. So basically what you wanna do is pull up and pull back, straight back. So let me go back a little bit more so that I got more space to go forward because I don't have enough space in front of me. Just remember that, all right? Uh, and uh, the place where you back up your trailer, it varies too about how much space you got in front of you, okay? Just remember that. So once you did that, once you start seeing your, your trailer start swinging out to the right, the front of the trailer starts swinging out to the right, pull up. Pull up your trailer straight. All right. You see that? And I hope you guys seen the rear camera. Here we go. You start fixing your trailer. Out more. Here we go. Straight line back. All you do is once you once you get yourself into that slot, all you have to do is straight line back. Bam! Into that slot. Make sure I'm on the submit. Make sure my make sure my uh, my landing gear is this directly on the submit. The mint strip on the shipper. Uh, so let me get out and show you guys how to uh, how to look. Make sure I'm in the slot. So this is what I looks like. See that? I mean, I'm perfectly straight in there. Remember, every time you come to the customer, make sure the landing gear is all perfectly on the uh, cement strip. I'm gonna go back and show you guys all the way around. See? Perfectly in. Alright, so I'm just gonna pull up a little bit or back up a little bit so that my my uh my trailer my, my landing gear is exactly on the cement strip. The reason why you wanna do that because cement strip cement, cement. the reason why you do that is because cement doesn't uh sink in. They don't 
But not like asphalt. Asphalt, once it get hot, they uh they they they, they make dips or they make grooves into the road. So alright, just remember that. Alright, have fun.